The Supreme Court of India has ruled down the mandatory use of the precursor to the microchip beast mark. The national ID stores information about citizens, including health records and whatever else a citizen volunteers to give to the Antichrist. Known as a pagan culture, Indians made the worship of the beast practical by embracing Babylonian devices as gods and sacrificing themselves as avatars. Long in the works, the mandatory ID forces citizens to eye scans, finger scans, and scans of other body parts. Although people may have similar features on the outside, they are in fact different on the inside and governments are hoping to store all of the person in the database accessed by the most powerful and secret societies in industries such as banking, insurance, and sex. After procuring assets by labor of others, royalty is taking a secure approach to the future, implementing such measures in places as Afghanistan, Iraq, Syria, and any region considered culturally at odds with these practices, resulting in provocation and funding to finish the plan of global domination by the beast. The Promotion Directive initiated from Britain where full-fledged propaganda ensued, consisting of digital interface ads, billboards, and pictures of people pretending to be interested. However, reality proved different as the government realized they were losing already depleted support and crowds turned to protest, chanting, Babylon burn! 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 